Hello, my name is Alpa Patel, and I'm here today to read this fantastic book for you. It is called, I Will Be Fierce. And I'd like to thank the Vigo County Public Library for giving me this opportunity, and Macmillan Publishing for uh, allowing, for printing this fantastic book. It is written by Bia Birdsong and Nindi Chanani. I will be fierce. I want to say I picked this book because the person and uh, the little young lady in the cover reminds me of me and also reminds me of my two little daughters that I have. Today, I will be fierce. I will answer the call to adventure. Look at this little girl. She's looking out the window. I wonder what she has ahead of her today. She just woke up. I will put on my armor. I will fill my treasure chest. I wonder what's in that treasure chest. I can't wait to see. Look at the colors on her shirt. Isn't that amazing? Look at all those different colors. Blue, purple, red, orange, yellow, green. I love that shirt. I will go forth to explore new worlds. I wonder where she's going. What new world is she gonna see? Today I will be fierce. I will take on the monsters that stand in my way. I don't see any monsters. Do you guys see any monsters? I see cute dogs, but maybe she's scared. Maybe she's talking about other monsters. Let's see what's ahead of her. I will drive back the dragons. I will dare to walk with the giants. I don't really see that many giants. And I don't see any dragons. Maybe she's nervous. Maybe she thinks she's going to see some dragons. Or maybe she's afraid of the bigger people. She's just nervous. She looks like she's going to school. Does that look like a school bus? That's a school sign. And that looks like, what do you think that looks like? I think that's a bus stop. And the kids are waiting for the school bus to pick them up. I will charge the many-headed serpent. What does that look like to you? That looks like a school bus. There's a lot of heads there. Maybe she's nervous about riding in the school bus, but I don't think there's a serpent. Today, I will be fierce. I will chart my own course. I think this little girl is trying to remind herself to be fierce. I think she's nervous about school, but she's confident that she's gonna do the best she can. I will climb the mountain of knowledge. What do you think that is? Look at that mountain of books. So many books, I can't wait to see what books she's reading. I will trick the guardian of wisdom into revealing her secrets. I think that's a librarian. I will solve the mysteries of the unknown. How do you think she's gonna solve those mysteries? By reading. She can't wait to read all these exciting books and see what the world has ahead of her. Today, I will be fierce. I will break away from the ordinary. What do you think that means? I think we'll wait and see. I will stand up for my beliefs. I will build new bridges. What is everybody looking at her for? Huh? What do you think is going on in that page? Why does she need to stand up for her beliefs? Is she different? Is she the same? I will build new bridges. She's making friends even though they're different. I will search for light in the darkness. 
Look at that. Do you really think it's dark outside, or do you think she's saying she feels a little sad maybe, but she's looking to feel happy and she found a way to do it? What do you think that means? I will search for light in the darkness. Looks like she found it though. She looks happy. Today, I will be fierce. I will claim my victory. I will conquer my fears. I will make my voice heard. So what is she doing here? What does that say? Show and tell. So I think she's going to show something or tell something. She's saying she's conquering her fears. Does she look nervous? But then she figured it out and she raised her hand. I will make my voice heard. I will be the hero of my own story. What do you think that means? She said she will make her voice heard. She's going to tell her story. Today, I will be fierce. I will lead the way home. So she's back on the school bus. And then I will rest. For tomorrow, I will be fierce again. What a great book. I just love this book. It's about a girl who I think started to be nervous about going to school, found her way, and is ready to do the same thing the next day and be her fiercest, be her best. Thank you.